All right, welcome to the channel. I'm John X Army. Today's news makes me an even bigger target. It makes people like you even bigger targets too. If you're a conspiracy theorist, if you're a truther, if you're a patriot, if you don't believe the mainstream narrative, today's news makes you an even bigger target. Expect mass censorship because of this. Now, what am I talking about? LA engineer derailed train near USNS Mercy over conspiracy theory. Expect mass censorship to come from this. But let's look at the story. A Los Angeles train engineer was arrested Wednesday for allegedly derailing a locomotive at high speed near the Navy hospital ship USNS Mercy, believing a conspiracy theory that the government is covering up the vessel's true purpose, federal authorities said. Edward Moreno, 44, of San Pedro, is accused of ramming the locomotive through two barriers at the end of the tracks Tuesday and coming to arrest in the gravel lot about 250 yards from the hospital ship, according to the Department of Justice. And here's what he had to say. When confronted, Moreno allegedly told Los Angeles Port Police that he thought the mercy was being used for something other than helping hospitals with the overflow of patients dealing with coronavirus. He said, you only get this chance once. The whole world is watching. According to an arrest affidavit, he said, I had to. People don't know what's going on here. Now they will. He allegedly also told the FBI that he did it to wake people up. Now keep in mind, this article makes him look absolutely insane. You can't count on getting the truth from the mainstream news. Who knows why he actually did it? Maybe he knew something we don't know. A 44-year-old train, train engineer doesn't just run their train off the tracks for no reason. What did he know that we don't, that we're not being told? Now, there's one more important piece to this puzzle that sounds a little odd. We're going to jump over to the Washington Post because they say something that kind of got my alarms going off. Take note of this paragraph from the Washington Post article. In interviews with the FBI and Los Angeles Port Police, Moreno said that everything was normal and no one was pushing his buttons. When he came to work on Tuesday morning, he said he hadn't spoken to anyone about wrecking a train and didn't even plan it himself until the idea came to him spontaneously that afternoon. What's that sound like? MK Ultra programming? Um, thought weaponry? Was that thought beamed into his head to do that for some other purpose? You really got to tear these stories apart and read between the lines. But uh, I think definitely this means we need to do some more research into the hospital ships parked at each end of the coast. Is there any way we can verify that those are hospital ships? Now, I'm not saying go out and do something crazy and end up in jail like Edward here. It sounds to me like they beamed him with some thought weaponry to make him do that crazy thing he did. I really want to hear your guys' thoughts and opinions on this story because a lot of times when something has my attention, uh, one of you guys come with a piece of information that leads to a, a, a better picture being painted. But I guarantee you one thing, because of this story, Expect to see mass censorship within the next two weeks. Expect YouTube channels to come down. Possibly expect the internet to come down. I love you guys very much. Please hit the thumbs up and share this video. Peace. John X Army signing out from the belly of the beast. Fuck yeah, America!